Hello guys, welcome in a new video. Today I want to present you the base uh, for the small squad, maybe two, maybe three persons, and also for a solo. This can be a different one than this, but still, still super duper. The raiders will hate you when you're gonna start doing this project. This base looks like shit. Uh, Many of you are gonna say, uh, this base I can uh, raid in five minutes. Are you sure? Are you ready for this video? This is gonna change this game forever. Let's go. When you play solo uh, and or you don't wanna really uh, make a base for yourself, probably you're gonna uh, leave your chest somewhere in the bush or maybe the bury in the nice place. But this can be uh, the risky way because the, some ASP, some cheaters, hackers can locate your uh, chest, digging out and take your stuff. But with this trick, uh, they never gonna happen. So let's let's think uh, you're gonna spend two three days in this area here and just keep your stash safe. So what you're gonna do? Uh, I will be taking the blueprint of the chest uh, like this and you're gonna search the ground uh, for the like this one over here you see how is going the blueprint up and down it's a small small hole over here let's uh, make this chest uh, over here and we're gonna bury this chest what this, uh, this small uh, hole is uh, important, you're gonna see in a second. Here we go, the, our chest is the berry right now. And what we're gonna do now, it's we're gonna craft the tent. And this is game changer. I'm doing this uh, on the engineering advance. So everything what is needed for that uh, you're gonna see from the engineering advance and we put our tent on the berry chest I can go a little bit uh, I think it's pretty nice like that and for engineering uh, advance this is very very cheap only 35 uh, the rope, 3 metal, 21 uh, racks, uh, you can easily cut from the uh, dead zombies, and 7 toolboxes. So it's very, very cheap. We craft this one, and our chest is under. It's not possible to dig it out by someone. Someone who's coming, they cannot do this. And why is this tent is so good? Is so cheap and have look at this 900 hit points so if someone wanna take your chest from there bury they need to use definitely some explosives I gonna take a TNT And look at this, TNT, like for everything else, take 200 uh, hit points from the tent. So to destroy them, you need to use 4 TNT and let's say 1 grenade or 5 TNT. For C4, you need to have 2 C4 plus 1 grenade, I think, so. yeah. So if someone want to take your chest, they're going to need to spend a lot of materials, a lot. If now next things, if you cannot find that uh, place when you can bury this chest pretty, pretty nice and easy, you can just make this chest inside. You can also plant the uh, wardrobe uh, here, 
but it's a small difference between them and I show you now what is the, the different for that one we can go from uh, another side and we're gonna shoot and the wardrobe can be destroyed by shooting from outside 71 percent but let's uh, check the chest right now uh, we can even shoot from uh, this position over here be easier and the chest is fully 100 percent but of course someone can come here and just take your chest but in this case we can protect our chest by making just one more here we go hop and there is not possibility to get inside they need to destroy this tent and using so much explosives uh, now we're gonna go to the base i made it and i explain you some more things now uh, we are back to the base and i buried the the chest over here maybe also we can use the the mine we can arm the trap next to it we can also the take it and and bury this this mine next to it and in this case i will be suggest you guys you can make how much uh, this tents you want and bury the chest in each one but only one only just one will be with your most important loot if you use the backpacks inside the big chest it's uh, more than enough space for your most valuable loot and imagine now the raiders will come here and need to spend so much materials to destroy your tents and they found nothing inside i can imagine how pissed off they're gonna be uh, from my perspective if i would become and i need to use so much tnt grenades or c4 to destroy the tent and i don't know what i got from there i think i will be avoid this i will be just leave this base and go away i'm not gonna search for the days for the tnt c4 collecting to destroy one tent and got nothing so just be sure you're gonna remember which tent uh, is your loot over there and even if like this I can go a little bit, little bit higher. Even I live like this. So even you can see if something is uh, actually buried here. Improvised metal chest. But in this position, you're not gonna have an option here to unbury. So you can see the mine is over here. And good luck. So... If you are really lazy and you don't want to make a base at all this is another tip you don't need to make uh, the walls at all you can actually your base can be just the line of the uh, tents just remember which one is contain your your loot so every time when you wanna uh, take your and put some more stuff inside your chest you destroy the correct one after that you plant uh, the tent again uh, i wanna see the raiders they see something like that that will be very very interesting so uh, another thing mm, why we cannot use this just for blockade your entrance that's uh, this this way i just leave a little bit for you guys so you can play for yourself 
maybe uh, here we can uh, put extra uh, the floor this is sometimes killing me of course you can go uh, under here and uh, lock pig and pass the door but this is the quest for you guys how to protect the doors by making the tents so that's will be that's it for today i hope you enjoy this kind of content so smash this like button consider subscribe and see you in the next video bye bye